Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Timmy Trico, also known as Horror Fan for Life, and I'm bringing you one more movie review for this afternoon. And this is a Lifetime original movie. Uh, it's a thriller that was released in 2016, and it's called Marriage of Lies. It currently holds a 5.1 out of 10 on IMDb and a 76% on Google. It was directed by Danny J. Boyle and written by Brian D. Young. And it stars April Bowlby, Virginia Williams, Faith Graham, Zach Garrett, Madison Eisman, Monique Green, and Corin Amell. And it centers around Rachel Wilson, uh, played by April Bowlby. If you don't know who April Bowlby is, she's been on numerous TV shows. She's most famous for uh, being on Two and a Half Men. Um, she played... Um, a One Night Flame with um, Charlie Harper, uh, Charlie Sheen's character, eventually became the wife to Alan Harper, played by John Cryer. Uh, she was on there off and on. I believe she did around 30 episodes or so. But uh, she's done a lot of other things as well. But this movie is about her, and it centers around her, her husband is missing and she waits about 48 hours to report him missing um, and then it all just turns back on her she immediately becomes a suspect uh, the police question her they search her house multiple times um, and then things start popping up evidence starts showing up and eventually it leads to her arrest so she has to try to um, prove her innocence and figure out what is going on. And as I'm watching this movie, you know, we've seen movies like this before. But I was interested to see what they were going to do with this movie. And uh, I, was, I was shocked. I was surprised. I was really surprised of um, what actually was going on. And who the culprit was and what was really going on. Um, as I said, we've seen the scenario before, um, and I don't want to give it away because this is a newer, uh, newer movie and everything. But we've seen it before. But with, this was a little bit different of a twist. Um, but nonetheless, this this was a really, really good movie. A very suspenseful, thrilling. I, I love Lifetime original movies. Hallmark movies. If you know me, you know my channel. Uh, I'm constantly watching those movies as well. Um, Lifetime has new movies on on Saturdays, uh, Saturday nights. Uh, Hallmark, uh, I believe, is Wednesday nights typically. But uh, yeah, th this Lifetime original movie was really good. Um, I loved um, the characters. Uh, Rachel Wilson played by Ever Boy was great. Um, even a little child actor in this movie was really good. Uh, yeah, it's just it's just a, a well-made movie. Um, I, I think this movie probably could have made some decent money at the box office had it had it released. But nonetheless, I enjoyed it. Um, and as I said, we've seen these types of movies before. But I like the direction they took this movie in the third act. And what they did with it, I was caught by surprise. Um, but it all made sense in the end. But yeah, it, it was a really good movie. So with that, I'm going to give Marriage of Lies a 9 out of 10 and two thumbs up. So check this movie out. Uh, it's definitely uh, uh, enjoyable. In the comment section below, if you've seen the movie, give me your thoughts and opinions. And what are your thoughts and opinions on... Lifetime and Hallmark original movies. Uh, as I've said before in the past on many other movie reviews and stuff, I love them. And uh, you could catch some really good movies on there. Um, I know Hallmark is known for its cheesy, you know, holiday movies and stuff, but I love them. I think they're great. And uh, so, yeah, definitely check this one out. As always, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell icon for all notifications. As I do movie reviews, TV show reviews, trailer reviews, top tens, and rankings. 
And as always, if there's anything you want me to do on my channel, let me know in the comment section below. I always respond to everyone's comments. Just make sure we keep it respectful and clean. And if you like this, give it a thumbs up. I thank you guys for watching and check you later.